Well, the crowdfunding is complete, and it looks like we're at the end of the road with updates. We are not sure, but they did send us version 1.12. So let's get started. First thing on the list is solve the grayscale missing problem when RGA converts to 16 rank grayscale. So I'm not sure what they mean by solve the grayscale missing problem, but when we toggle it into gray, it does look fine. And when we go back into color, it looks fine as well. So whatever they thought they were missing, they seem to have fixed it. For the techie crowd, items two through five are gonna be a little bit, well, technical. So let's just read them off here and you guys can do some testing when you receive it. Modify the power timing of the e-paper panel. EBC driver update, support the alignment operation of the eight pixel grid, solve the display error in DU mode and optimize the stability problem of the high frequency of IPDDR4 slash 4X. Correct the display position of the current page and total pages for a single note. They're referring to this. Before it said two out of one, where it should have said two out of two or one out of two. So they did correct that, that's really nice. Solve the bug of floating ball deviates from finger position when long pressing it. So when I long press it, it no longer deviates from my finger position and stays directly on point. So that's very nice. And finally, support A2 mode in black and white mode. Some bugs still exist in color mode. So under refresh mode, you do have display, graphic, web mode, and video mode. Of course, when the updates are finally finalized and we're ready to go with a, a follow-up review on a finished product, we will show you the differences in all four of the views and the different modes. Right now, this is graphic mode or web mode, basically, where it allows you to use the web browser in a much smoother experience. I must say it still has this little bit of shortcomings. There's still a fair amount of staining in the background. However, it is leaps and bounds better than when it started. So this is V1.12 for the Re-Inkstone R1 as of July 30th, 2021. If you guys have any other questions, comments, or concerns, let us know down below.